Well, it's very early in the season, but we have the top two involved today, and it could have a lot of significance down the road a ways. We're moments away. Join us for the kickoff, and it's live. Alan Smith is with me. I'm Martin Tyler. Delighted to have your company for this match today. Our match today, Swindon Town versus Barnet. Well, it's still fairly early in the season, Martin, but uh, to see these two teams coming up against each other at this point, it's a really enticing battle. We're in for some fireworks here. It follows number six, Oliver Lancashire. Number seven, Paul Mullen. But when you're a forward and you come into a new club, you know from your own experience, Alan, you want to make a good start. Here's his chance. It's his start today. Yeah, a goal here would certainly help his cause. It would relax him. You don't want to go three, four, five games not having found the back of the net. It's a debut for the new forward today. Yeah, and with that comes a little bit of pressure because everyone's expecting you to score the goals. The fans are, I think. Swindon Town. Hoping for another win. They played well last time out. They won at home against Crawley Town. Should be buoyant after that 3 0 win, but uh, probably a draw for them here. Good game out there. Good luck. Cheers. Thanks. Good game. Good game. Good game. This is the home team lineup. We've got it down as a 4 3 3. Yeah, it's a system that the Netherlands used to use all the time. I think really they invented it and uh, plenty of countries have adopted it since. If it works, it's, it's really uh, tough to handle. Thank you. Enjoy the game. Have a look now at the lineup for the visiting team. Well, we put it up. And what looks, Alan, very defensive, but there's flexibility, isn't there, in the side? Yeah, and I think with his shape, so much depends on the wing-backs, how much they are allowed to get forward and what they can do when they do get forward. It should be a tremendous game, and uh, here we go. Now they can go forward, having won the ball. Forte. It's Jackson. Richards. Absolutely no trouble for the goalkeeper here to save that shot from distance. Getting forward well as a team now. Very much in free kick territory. This foul. Rash Allen, reckless. Well, he's tried to go for the slide tackle, and uh, he's a faction off getting the ball. It is a foul. looking to get forward a bit cleared away well away from goal Forte on to the attack now very good piece of work by the goalkeeper to turn that away from danger Shoots! That's hit 
the bar and it's still in play. It was good play until they got that challenge in. He thought he might have connected a bit better than that. It's a simple save in the end from the long shot. Goal news now from Crawley. It's a goal for Crawley Town. 20 minutes played, 1-0. Cheers, Alan. He's very confident with the ball at his feet. Porte. Attacking now. Has a go here. He's reached it and turned it aside. Put in from the wide area. Put away, but not out of harm's way. Well, it's out for a corner. It wasn't the easiest ball to strike, actually, and he did well to hit it the way he did with real power, but unlucky to hit the bar. And that shot's blocked very quickly. Still got a bit to do. Letting the shot go. It's a good goal for them, and they have been playing well. No one can really complain about them taking the lead here. They have been much the better side, and it's a fine piece of finishing. In truth, Alan, this is what we expected. The dominant side, and they're showing that on the scoreline. Yeah, we don't always get what we expect, but uh, they've been good value here. They've played well, particularly the strikers. Oh, look at the manager. He works hard on his team on the training ground, and he's seen some reward for it down there now. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Keep you right up to date during this match with what's going on elsewhere. And here's Alan McAnally. It's a goal for the home team, 29 minutes played, 1-0. Well, interesting news again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. I think the deflection there made the interception possible. Cross has gone straight to the defender who's got time for an extra touch. Interesting to see what footwear the teams are going to actually use today now that this uh, rain is coming down. Might have to change what they originally started with. Yeah, and I think sometimes with the lads wearing blades these days, you do see them slipping a bit more. And uh, Hit it well! It was close enough to think for a moment that they might have gone two in front. Yeah, I mean, it's not the easiest, but uh, it was a decent... Effort not far away from the target at all. Just a change now. He's bringing on a new player. That's a turnover. The possession here. Jackson made sure the ball is stuck at his foot. It's Jackson. That's a brilliant stop. It'll be a corner. Goalkeeper rising to the occasion, literally. Yeah, he would have been disappointed to get beaten, but. Nevertheless, had to keep his eye on the ball. The shot's on. Here's a chance, the goalkeeper exposed. Momentary respite with a save. over the bar another corner here's the shot from distance 
Well, nowhere near. Uh, it was a long way out. Yeah, I think that's a waste to try his luck from there. And the shot had plenty of conviction, but it had too much height. Yeah, it would have been a worldie, that. And uh, he's capable of it, but not today. And that's half-time. Signaled by the referee. 1-0 the half-time score. So, Alan, what about the first 45 minutes he's played on his debut today? Well, I was expecting better from this player. I mean, he's got the second half to remedy the situation. The good news is his team... Will... And they kick off at the start of the second half. Goal news from Carlisle. It's a second goal for the visitors. 40... Wonderful save. Had to really reach out for that. Delivered into the box. Comes out with a punch to clear the danger. Porter turning out to be... What about this for a shot? Optimistic. Well, that was ambitious, but the ambition very nearly paid off. Well, we've been speaking to the player ourselves, and we know that he wanted this move, and he's finally got it. Yeah, I mean, we've been reading about it for quite some time and it does appear to be quite an exciting transfer this one Forte and here they are on the attack full on the frame of the goal and that's really the way to get the ball out of the danger zone Forte Straightforward save for the goalkeeper. Norris. We're going to get a corner here because of that deflection. Well, he's had a go. Uh, saw it all the way, the goalkeeper, and it's comfortable in the end. A goal from uh, Cheltenham. It's a second goal for Stevenage. 65 minutes played, 2-0. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. Substitution now. And he's up a bit of time here as well for the team that want to hang on to this lead. Al Shamari. Forte. Nice goal! What a moment for him on his debut for his new club. It's a super goal. Well, it's the perfect start, isn't it? And that'll give him so much confidence for the weeks ahead. When he hit it, I think he might have been worried that it would go over the bar, but it was below the bar, certainly off the bottom of the bar and in. Yeah, I'm not sure whether he actually meant to hit it that high up, but uh, he doesn't care now. He's loving that goal. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Al Shamari. Just taking the heat out of the moment, the ball back to the goalkeeper. And it's gone for a corner. We're going to make a change at fullback now, Alan. And. He's had a difficult opponent to deal with, to be fair. Well, he has, and uh, his opponent has been too much for him in terms of his pace and skill. Been a torrid afternoon for this lad.
corner. Definitely destined for the goalkeeper. And he makes it his. Forte. Good position. They've worked this attack. And he scores! Well, look at his face. He's absolutely delighted with that. And why wouldn't you be scoring on your debut? That's a great goal from long range. Well, I think if you ask the player afterwards, he'll say he has never struck a sweeter ball than that. That is what the fans love to see. A goal hit like that. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking for. One team really on their game today, Goal the other very off colour. Number 17, Mark It's Richards. Smith. Well, the ball's been deflected out, so it'll be a throw in. Forte. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. Well, that's an absolutely stunning strike. I cannot believe he took that on, Martin. It, it stunned me and it certainly stunned the keeper. Well, they'll be showing that over and over again. It is some hit for that goal. Well, to be fair, they stood off him. He had the space, he had the time. And boy, did he make them play. From the moment he hit it, you can see he knew it was going in. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. We're going to get a substitution now from the manager. He has the fullback who's going to come off. What do you make of that, Alan? Well, he's offered nothing going forward, and he's not been able to stop the crosses coming in from that side. Not surprised by the substitution. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Well, from that distance, that was pretty close. Yeah, it looked like the keeper was worried for a second there. He's doing more, isn't he, than just keeping them ticking over in midfield. He's, he's running the show. I think it's that game intelligence as well, isn't it? You don't always have to run about to receive the ball. He's been very cute in his movements, as you can see, and got himself some assists. Neatly intercepted. And the referee certainly not uh, flagging in his application of the law. Free kick. Well, that's late. He's going to have to get booked for that, I'm sure. A yeah, silly challenge. And, uh, you know, if he ends up getting sent off, he's only got himself to blame. Well, you run the risk when you go to ground like that with a slide tackle of getting into serious trouble. Well, he's dived in. It's a reckless one. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Richards. Well, they could... Oh, he's going to shoot from here. It's a goal! Well, it's all downhill from here, isn't it? Two goals on his debut. He won't forget today. Well, you're too young to remember, Alan, but they used to have square goalposts, and a lot more came out than went in in those days. So, for the attackers... That's a, a bonus of the change in the technology and in off the post. Yeah, and I think he deserved that, though, because uh, struck it well and right into the corner. It is now an extraordinary lead, and you could say really game over. Sometimes being a favourite in a match can weigh heavily, expectation and all that. It's not a problem for this team, is it? No, I think their manager will be delighted because they've not uh, taken it easily at all. They've given respect to their opponents, but they've shown their class too.
Richards. Oh, that's such a classy goal. Well, that's absolutely fantastic. First appearance for this new club, and he's got two goals. Oh, incredible. Everything he's touching, he's turning to gold here. He has hit that like a rocket. Didn't he just? He's a long way out, but the keeper had absolutely no chance. He certainly did. Great strike. And we can see a slightly different viewpoint on it. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. Well, it's a tough game for the team that are trailing. They're out of the... Co and the referee brings it to a halt. Well, at times you thought they got a bit greedy, but why not? I mean, if you're on top of an opponent like they were here today, rub it in. Well, they did. They were ruthless, weren't they? They rubbed their faces into the dirt, and uh, that is the hallmark of the top side. That's his first appearance for his new club, isn't it, Alan? How have you evaluated what he's achieved in the match? Well, so often we think of his creative abilities, but a couple of goals here...